Okay, Tubies. Um, I'm gonna try something a little different. Um, Miss Sylvia Dawn asked me if it was possible for me to, or if, it, if I know of any way of doing a past life reading. I have never done something like that, but um, I thought it was a good idea, and and so I gave it. I'm gonna give it a try. I'm gonna explain it as I go, of course, but um. It's going to be for her because she gave me the idea. Um, like I said, this is new, so if this is, seems wrong in any way, I mean, please, I mean. Okay. First card generally is going to represent um, who you are. I have the full card. I want to say you were a young traveler. Um, or perhaps a, uh, I'm specifically drawn to her, uh, her book in her hand. If you can see that, her little book. Um, a traveling writer, I want to believe. Perhaps a poet or a bard. Um, but yeah, you're very young. Um, that's, that's basically all I can get out of that. Um, the next card is for the, uh, the place. It's the sun card. It's a... The sun is telling me a place of... Uh, hold on. Ooh. Sitting very uncomfortably here. A, a, a place that's very bright, but very um, bountiful, very prosperous. There we go. I'm, I'm going to go out on a limb. I want to say either... Um, it's obviously Europe, because any other place I could think of that's bright is Egypt, but not necessarily bountiful. Um... It's in Europe, your European country, a place where it's real bright. Um, I'm thinking uh, more along the lines of uh, of like Greece or Rome, because they're very prosperous, but yet um, it, they were very clear. There was never like there was not very much. There wasn't very much, uh, I can't get my words, there wasn't very much vegetation, there we go. So it was all city. Um, I want to say you traveled throughout Europe, you were a bard who traveled throughout Europe. And generally, the next card is for time. And it was in a time where there was a lot of chaos. So I want to say the Middle Ages, perhaps when, um, Rome was first be becoming... Uh, this is the Dark Ages, what this card is telling me, the Dark Ages, um, where Rome was developing and it's conquering countries. Um, so what I'm, I'm guessing, if you're a traveling bard, you, I want to say you're a spiritualist in this case. Um, I'll have to clarify on that later. Um, so who you are, place, time, and the last one is your death. <laughs> the Ten of Swords. Okay. It's becoming quite relevant to me now. Uh, is this making any sense to you at all? I mean... This is the Ten of Swords. Uh, and this woman was just... And this, and the, the story of this woman in this deck is she just got burned. Um, I think you were... on something. Seven of Wands of who you are. Um, you're a very sk skilled spiritualist. I'm going to look the exact definition of that card here. Just to be, um, just to be, uh, sure. Combat, defending yourself, 
and your plans, awakening your interior force, working with your interior force, your guide. Okay. Now I'm almost entirely sure. You were a traveling, uh, well, I want to I guess a witch at the time, or a spiritualist, perhaps even a medicine man, very young, but you were, um, you were viewed the most as, you were, as a witch. You had an ability that stood out, that generally people didn't like. Therefore, you were accused, arrested, and burned. Um, clarify that one a little bit. The High Priestess. Um, you were burned by somebody in high power. It was, I mean, um, somebody who felt threatened by you. It's one of high spiritual powers. I'm guessing the church again. Um, and generally that's what I'm getting from you. Um, this is not in any specific format. I'm just drawing random cards. And now, you are a person, this is the lust, very free spirit, it's a very free spirit, you're very free spirited now, because of these, these factors, it has done a lot for the world, and you are currently doing a lot more for the world. Um, I think I might write this, this spread down, I mean look what it's created, it's perfect, um, I think I might put this spread down in my book of shadows, use it lighter. So yeah, past life readings. Didn't know I was able to do that. I ho I hope this shines some insight on you. Um, any questions? I, I will be free to do it again if you'd like. Please rate, uh, refer me to others. You're already a subscriber and friend. And I thank you for that. Thank you for my s subscribers, by the way, and friends. And um, but yeah, that's your reading. And uh, blessed be.